Now that we've completed our pre-operational checks and our walk around, we now need to conduct a pre-start check. This is where we get onto the machine, check all the electrical components and all the moving parts. I'm gonna demonstrate that to you now. First up, we need to use our three points of contact. Very important, not to, not to hold onto the steering handle. Use our footstep, mounting handle, handle on the seat, up we climb. First thing we do, must put on our seatbelt. Once we've done that, get some ignition, we'll check all, all our electrical components. So I'll start with the lights, blinkers, on both sides. I'm now gonna start the machine to check the brake lights and other warning devices. Brake lights. Flashing light. The horn. And also check the gauges. Before we actually start moving off on this machine, we need to check all lifting components. I'll demonstrate that now. Full back tilt. Full forward tilt. And it's very important to bring the mask back to a vertical position. Then need to do full side shift in both directions and back to the center. Now I'm going to raise the mast to its full extent. All the while checking that the chains, hoses are running over those pulleys freely. And for any unusual noises. As you can see, I've selected the correct travel position with the fork arms. They're below the front axle height and close to the ground. I'm now going to engage uh, the, the forward gear with my foot on the brake and I'm going to check the handbrake. By simply releasing the foot on the pedal, it holds, that's fine. Release my handbrake. I'm going to check over both shoulders. It's a good idea to check your back wheels are straight. We know the area is clear around us. We're going to proceed forward to check the brakes. Front brakes are good. We're now going to do the same in reverse. Checking over both shoulders. Always watching your travel direction. Rear brakes are great. The last thing we need to check is uh, the steering on this machine. And we need to do that by utilizing the steering wheel in both directions to its full degree. Once again, always check in over your shoulders for any pedestrians. And that brings us to the completion of pre-start checks.